Typical Lord Steven Regal here as we get ready to kick this one off. Rarely do you see this man exude any type of emotion. Well, any type other than disgust, of course. I just get the feeling that Lord Steven Regal, a self-described blue blood, sees all of us as peasants. A quick punch to the gut. He was able to reverse that. And he hits the drop kick. What impact. Boy, he was able to reverse it and get out of that. Oh, big elbow. Let's do it. He's enjoying this. And turning it around. It's Lord Steven Regal with the reversal. He gets out of trouble there. Ah, oh, there's the kick by Lord Steven Regal. And he's displaying tremendous viciousness. Oh, what's Ric Flair going to do with this? And remember, we still have that blockbuster main event tonight. Oh, yeah, Michael. It doesn't get any bigger than this. The championship is on the line, and that's going to happen live tonight. Without a doubt, Lord Steven Regal is one of the most polished scientific wrestlers WCW has ever seen. Between his array of suplexes, hammer locks, and leg locks, I don't think there's a move that Regal doesn't know. Hey, with a 180, Lord Steven Regal, the reversal. Jeez. Oh, look at this. Not the position you want to be in. I'd agree that Regal is extremely proficient when it comes to scientific wrestling. But what impresses me the most is how effortless he makes it look. I mean, he just rolls into a surfboard like it's second nature. We're going to slap on a cross-face chicken wing out of nowhere. It's amazing. Yeah, and you know what? When all else fails, he just goes for the cheap shot. He'll even tell you himself, Regal's a dirty, rotten scoundrel. Disdain in the eyes of the Viper. Ooh. 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 Oh, wait. They call Lex Luger's signature move the torture rack for a reason. When he has it locked in and he applies the pressure and starts jumping up and down, his opposition has only two choices. Submit or suffer a broken back. Reversal. Got out of the way of that one. Randy Orton is doing an excellent job dominating this match. Some adversity right now. Wow! Lex Luger is a force within the ring. So many of the industry's top stars have fallen victim to Lex Luger's torture rack over the years. Scott Hall, Randy Savage, Hulk Hogan. The list is endless. Yeah, and even more impressive is the fact that the torture rack is just one of the many ways Luger can beat you. He's also put down many top stars with that forearm smash of his. And not to mention the pile driver, which I, of course, know a thing or two about. Looks like somebody wants back in this match. Orton's got him. Oof, man. He 
He desperately, desperately needs to make a tag here. After all of these shots to the head, I've got a feeling that Soup's going to be on his diet for the foreseeable future. You know, versatile is a word that comes to mind when I watch Lord Steven Regal compete. He's just so resourceful and can adapt to any fighting style. If you want to brawl, he'll brawl. If you want to wrestle, he'll wrestle. Orton is so cunning, so vicious. When he counters, he knows exactly how to follow them up with one of the most devastating of moves. Now back to the ring. Oh, and he's going to have to do something big here. His partner is in bad shape. And he has to make a tag to his fresh partner. Oh, this hits it. He's out. We got a cover. And he stops the count. His partner's being punished, and he's seen it up. He anticipated that move perfectly. And here comes Randy Orton. Man, there's no getting up from that. Another incredible battle of Randy Orton's was when he squared off against Batista. And that should do it. Shoulders are down. Two and a half. Is the ref deliberately counting slowly? Look at that, Cole. Look at Lex Luger making his move. They have to submit here. Referee asking. Well, he's going to have to block out the pain if he hopes to escape this. The damage has definitely been done. Now it may just be a matter of time. Force back inside. His partner doesn't have much left, and he might need to do this one on his own. Big time strength there. Oh, heads up move there by Luger. Moving on pure instinct. Oh, nice counter. Ric Flair is not someone to sleep on. Uh-oh. What's Ric Flair going to do now? Oh, good night. And a referee barely had time to begin a count there. These are great competitors. Great, tremendous gladiators here in WWE. And Ric Flair reverses it. Beautiful counter by Flair. Only the Nature Boy can execute a reversal with such style. What a display of power. Look out. And that series ends in deadlock. Neither one of these superstars can afford to give their opponent the upper hand.
strength. Oh, and he got dropped. And there he goes, under the bottom rope. And maybe some order will be restored here. Get ready, folks. Get ready. Wow, what a sequence. What an amazing display of power. behind that move. He saw that one coming. That was just unadulterated power. Can he score the pin? Oh, talk about a timely save. This match isn't over yet. Pure power. Just physically dominant. Oh, what a counter. Looks like somebody wants back in this match. Oh, man. How do you beat an opponent that can do that to you? match this is unreal whoa he's measuring and the ref is now completely distracted he thinks he has it Two. and randy orton just manages to get the shoulder out Steven Regal providing a substantial beatdown. And he does it one more time. And here comes his partner. Here are your winners, Lex Luger and Lord Steven Regal. I love a good tag team match, and this one was unforgettable. These teams gave us everything they had, and the WWE Universe is the true winner in this one.